Hey, it's lovely meeting you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. Welcome to Argentina. Thank you. How Happy about that? First time here? Yeah. How did you like it so far? Amazing. I wish I could stay. Really? Yeah, I wish I could stay for a lot longer. What did you have time to do? Walk around in your free time? Yeah, yesterday we spent the day. We Where did went you go? to La Boca. Oh, La Boca. Which is beautiful. You went to um, the stadium actually? No, no, to the, to the neighborhood. To the okay. neighborhood. Please tell me about the series because everyone is like super excited about. Oh, good. Yeah. We're I really guess you too. To here. Yeah. There's yeah. A lot of expectations so what can you tell me about yeah. this new project well, it's based on a, a novel by joe hill who's stephen king's son so uh -huh. it's got this um this kind of flavor of that supernatural horror uh narrative um it's essentially the story of vic mcqueen who's a young girl in massachusetts waking up to her own power and struggling with her place in the world um, and she realizes that she possesses the ability to cut through the boundaries between reality and imagination. Mm -hmm. uh, and on the other side of those boundaries is this whole um, landscape of places that uh, are ruled by this character called Charlie Manx. Which is and you, obviously. Me, yeah, yeah. And so uh, Charlie Manx is a vampire of sorts who kidnaps young children and steals their, their souls. souls. Right? Yeah, yeah. And, becomes vital and youth, youthful again, and so Vic is, you know, Vic and Charlie are the uh, are the nemeses of one another, and uh, and spend the whole season trying to bring each other down. What is the best about being in this type of project? Well, the people were the best thing about this experience. Jamie really? O'Brien, who's our showrunner and creator, and. Uh, uh, yeah, the cast are all incredible and the, everybody, the creative team is just really exciting and also the transformation that I got to... It's um, amazing. Yeah, it's really it's cool and super that's cool. a unique experience for me to dive into this character and really disappear into the physical and vocal transformation. It was what, really fun. What actually happened when you see yourself looking like that? I mean, it's pretty... Uh, the first time you actually saw yourself It's as pretty charming. gnarly, yeah. It's, uh, <laughs> it's, it's remarkable to see uh, what's possible. You know, mm -hmm. uh, when I took the job, I said to Kari Skoglund, who directed the first two episodes, and Jamie O'Brien, uh, you know, we really need to find the best special effects makeup artist. And uh, Joel Harlow, who's an Academy Award winning special effects makeup artist, really like the top of the of the industry, um, and someone who I've worked with before on the Star Trek films, was uh -huh. available and interested and came on board and helped us create this incredible look for Charlie. And that was a huge relief. How long um, would it take? Well, the oldest look took about four hours. Yeah, it was wow. a, a real commitment. I didn't have to do that every day, but it was definitely um, part of the experience um, significantly throughout.